ancient ruins, pristine landscapes. Some of the world's most unforgettable tourist destinations are in developing countries. These are places on Earth that astound travelers, that feature legendary structures and ways of life that have remained almost the same for centuries. This is Cambodia, a nation of around 16 million people. Every year, almost 5 million tourists pour into the country to admire the stunning beauty of the Angkor Wat temples. And hundreds of hotels have sprung up in the cities to accommodate them. But outside the city limits, in places like these, in villages sometimes virtually untouched by the outside world, there's a problem. People are getting sick. Every year, worldwide, in places like these, 1.6 million people die because of unsafe water, poor sanitation, and lack of hygiene. Hygiene! It's easy for us to take something like washing your hands for granted. We do it without even really thinking about it. But it turns out that hand washing is fundamental. It turns out that hand washing with soap is the single most effective action you can take to stop the spread of illness before it can start. Hand washing has been shown to reduce the presence of harmful bacteria by more than 90%. So why isn't everyone just washing their hands? For some people living in developing countries, soap just isn't available. And if it is, it's just too expensive. And sometimes, a lack of hygiene education means people aren't even aware of how important hand washing is. Why spend a day's wages on a bar of soap? But meanwhile, back in the cities, Back at those hundreds of hotels, tourists are arriving and leaving as quickly as they got there. And they're leaving behind soap. And lots of it. Think about it. When you stay in a hotel, you use that soap bar a few times and the rest just gets thrown away. It's estimated that around the world, the hotel industry throws away the equivalent of 5 million bars of soap every single day. That's 3,000 bars of soap every minute. But what if we could turn all that trash into treasure? Enter EcoSoap Bank. EcoSoap Bank is an international humanitarian and environmental nonprofit organization working to save, sanitize, and supply recycled hotel soap for the developing world. Here's how it works. Step one, hire economically disadvantaged women in developing countries at good wages. Give them a steady, well-paying job so they can feed their families. Train them as soap makers and give them language lessons and other skills they'd need to eventually get a different job they might want. Step two, collect gently used soap bars from local hotels and bring them back to local Eco Soap Bank branches. Step three, thoroughly sanitize the soap bars and process them into new ones. Throw in some herbs or spices from the local area. Make the soap special. Step four, Donate the recycled soap bars to schools, hospitals, and village communities. Pair every donation with hand-washing training sessions and other hygiene education. Make sure that good habits are established and that soap is recognized as valuable. Step five, rinse and repeat. Eco Soap Bank has recycled more than 90,000 pounds of soap and served more than 700,000 people through more than a million soap donations in developing countries around the world. Soap recycling is a bold new way to address poverty, protect the environment, and defend people against disease. By leveraging existing infrastructure and focusing on prevention, EcoSoap Bank is working to impart the tools and the skills to keep people healthy. <laughs>